you guys what's up welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new my name's lauren it is around 12 o'clock i am about to change and get ready i might wear this top but i think i'm not i'm not gonna wear sweatpants i'm wearing sweatpants right now um and i don't think i'm gonna wear that but i am going to my dad's house and we're getting our family together christian's coming too and we're celebrating my sister graduating from college she got her bachelor's degree in hospitality management i also got my bachelor's degree in hospitality management as well we both went to ucf and um we did the rosen college of hospitality and it's actually number one in the nation for hospitality and number two in the world as like a hospitality school so i think that's really cool and it's such an honor to have graduated from a school that ranks so high but we are going there to celebrate her so i'm very excited for her it's a big moment and um we're all so proud of her i wanted to show you this mug i got this mug it's from starbucks actually i saw it a few weeks ago when i was getting my when i was going to get my hair done and i went inside to pick up a starbucks drink i saw it and i don't know why i didn't get it then because they only make a few of these and they sell out really quickly and i should have just bought it then i didn't so i bought it off poshmark for probably like 15 dollars more than what they're sold for i think they're 10 dollars. they might be a little bit more but i bought it for like 26 dollars off of poshmark i ordered it last week and it just came yesterday last night i just got it out of the mailbox so i'm gonna basically be using this every single day until christmas and probably after christmas as well for at least a little bit it has glitter that moves in in the handle so it's just a glass mug super cute she also packaged it up really cute as well she i never do this when i sell my clothes on poshmark and i feel like i should she wrote a thank you card <laughs> she gave me a starburst she gave me a starbucks bag so cute and she wrapped it up with a thank you sticker with tons of bow wrap. I saved it so I could show you guys, but I think that's such a nice touch. I was like, oh my goodness, this is packaged up so cute. She wrote a thank you card. I don't know. It's something so simple and it was just nice that she did. This will probably, this video will be going up after Christmas, so you probably won't even be looking for mugs like this, but if you want to get this mugs, and if you use like Christmas mugs or certain holiday mugs year round. Um, I bought it off Poshmark. There's so many people that are selling mugs like this on Poshmark and eBay. The person that I actually bought this from, I think she does this to make money, extra money, because she had a ton of Starbucks cups <laughs> that she was selling. People obviously upcharge them, but yeah, I'm a little nuts, but I spent like 26 bucks on this mug. But I like it. And I think this year is all about doing little things that bring you joy. What are your interests? Oh, you did? Oh, This is sad. She, really is. she literally yeah. just lets you hold her. She's a very calm. Yeah, she is. So lovely. Why is she loving like this? Because they're like freaking out. Like, right? right? Yeah, going crazy. She might be really tired. Yeah, it kind of seems that no, way. No, I think she just loves me. <laughs> Look at this. Look. It's only love. Oh, you're just a sweet girl. Picked the wrong day to wear leggings. Come get Cinny. <laughs> come and try to come in, in the camera. I don't want it to like hurt the dog. <laughs> exchanging gifts right now and Christian made me go on the balcony. He ripped up a piece of paper with four gift options and had me pick one and he made me come out here so he could get it out. When I picked it, he goes, wow, this is a good one. This is a good one. Go out on the balcony. So I hate surprises. I hate them. So I'm just like really nervous to see what this gift is. But um, I got him one of his gifts tonight. So. I didn't get to wrap it because they're not all wrapped yet, so. 
I'm scared. <laughs> it's the Nespresso. It's unbelievable. That's the one you picked. That's funny. How did I pick that? That's why I said, wow, that's just ridiculous. Because I, I didn't want I it to actually be that. I wanted it to be one of the other ones. So funny because in the car I said that I wanted to open this one. Oh, it came. Did you get these too? It came with them? I don't know. Maybe I added a little extra, extra spice in there for you. Oh, I love them. Oh, thank you for getting me those. I don't even know what they are. They're double shot of espresso. Perfect. They're the ones that I drink too. Are they the ones that you drink? They are the ones that I drink. Because there's two types and those are the ones that I buy. I love these mugs. I don't know why I love them so much, but I love them so much. I don't have my car mount up. I don't have it out because I put it up during the week and I haven't vlogged in my car yet. I don't want you to fall while I'm backing out. Um, but I don't know if I mentioned it, that dog that you saw, my half brother and his wife got a dog. It seems Sally. I was following the dog around all day, just, just wanting to hold it. It's the cutest dog. It sits in your lap, literally sits in your lap, won't move, isn't hyper, was sleeping. So cute, so cute. We're going to Longhorn right now. You can't even see me. Yeah. You can only get out easy. That's how Mercedes is too. That color is. Yeah, it's, okay, I didn't think that you would like that. The Longhorn, Christian got the Longhorn steak. We went to Longhorn for dinner and he got the Longhorn steak and it's like a, a filet with, it's a filet with a what? Strip? Porterhouse. Porterhouse? Yeah. And Christian liked the seasoning on it so much that the sweet waitress wrote down all of the seasonings that they put on that steak. So now we have it and we're gonna try it next time we cook steaks probably. We're stopping at the mailbox and to empty out the trash and Christian's getting one of my Christmas gifts. Is he hiding it? Is not in his shirt. <sighs> He's hiding it in his shirt. <laughs> you are not. I thought it wasn't even the way. <laughs> You're ridiculous. Hello, it's the next day. I didn't feel like doing my hair today, so I just put it up in a bun. I'm going to Publix. I'm making chili for dinner. I'm gonna slow cook it. I will post the recipe if you're interested. It's really good. Okay, I have like 20 minutes to start cooking this chili. I'm meeting Taylor and Maya at Agave Azul, which I feel like in every vlog, I'm always like, we're going to Agave Azul, we're going to this Mexican restaurant, but it's a really good Mexican restaurant and it's not Tex-Mex at all. It's very authentic. I'll post the recipe down below for the chili that I make. It's really good and I slow cook it so I'm gonna slow cook it for six hours so it'll be ready around six o'clock because it's almost one and it'll probably be all in the crock pot by one o'clock so I'm meeting them there at 1 15 so
they like I disrespected them by microwave my microwaving my water. But I agree with them. I just thought microwaving water was more common than I guess it is. I don't know. Maybe I'll ask my YouTube followers or subscribers or people that watch my videos. So I went to Target. Can you turn it down just a little? So I went to Target and I got some hangers and the main reason why I was I was already wanting to buy this, but I was kind of pushed a little bit harder to buy this because someone commented on one of my YouTube videos um, basically saying how I disrespected them because I microwaved my water to make my morning lemon water. And um, she was like, you're disrespecting British people. I don't know, she was British, I don't know. So I bought an electric, electric, right? tea kettle. Nothing against her. It made me laugh, but um, she basically said in all caps like how weird it was that I was microwaving water and then she goes in all caps, get a kettle. That's how I got a kettle. I'm kind of excited to use it. I didn't realize how affordable these were. Maybe I would have bought one sooner. My old general manager at my job made me a bunch of, well made us a bunch of little goodies and one of them was this spiced cider and she put instructions on it she like baked us all this stuff too and then she also got us this like um peppermint cocoa one mix do you press oh Whoa, it's really good. You have to try it. Okay, I've been sitting right here editing a video. Christian actually got me this computer stand. I asked for a few things for Christmas off of Amazon, and this makes such a difference if you're on your computer a lot, like I am <laughs> editing videos for YouTube. It makes a difference having it elevated. It helps with your posture. I just added the kidney beans to the chili because we're about to eat it and Christian and I love eating chili with these biscuits I'll show you the container tastes really good dipping it in the chili and just eating it on the side <laughs> I removed this <laughs> from the counter because I was tired of seeing it in my videos but um, we actually kind of use it so I don't know why I moved it away there's this place in South Florida called <laughs> Skyline Chili that it originates from Cincinnati. It originates from Cincinnati. Christian loves it. I've been there once when we went to South Florida a few years ago, but he goes just about every time he goes home. And they put chili over a noodles, noodles. <laughs> loaded up like oh, this. But here's my bowl I just did. Plain bowl of chili, no pasta.